Hi, in this video we'll be covering how to use a Trimble S7. We'll be covering leveling, creating new jobs, setting the back site, setting a foresight, moving stations, recording data, and finally ending the survey. Start by selecting the general survey tab. Next, hit the total station icon in the top right of the screen. Select level. This screen shows how level your instrument is. Take your time and level this total station accurately. When you're happy, hit accept. The next step is to create a job file on the hand controller that your data will be saved to. Note the current job on the top of the screen. To create a new job, click the job tab. Select new job. If you're working to MGA coordinates, select MGA. If you're using arbitrary coordinates, use scale factor 1. Make sure the coordinate system is set to 1. Type in your job name. I'll be calling this test. You can add additional notes and descriptions on the second page of the screen. When you're happy, click accept and you'll be taken back to the main menu. We're now up to setting up our initial station. Hit measure, VX and S series, station setup. Make sure the instrument is leveled and hit accept. Check your corrections. Type in the initial station name. We usually like to use one. Give it a station code, 004 is station. If you're doing a feature survey which requires levels, make sure to get an accurate instrument height. Make sure you correctly set where you measure to. Enter the height of the instrument. Next type in the coordinates. I'm using arbitrary coordinates of 1000 east, 5000 north, 100 height. Hit accept. Station 1 now is a recording on the controller. The final step in setting up the initial station is to plug in the back site. Take note of the height of the target. Name your back site. We've called it station 2. Code of 004 which is station. Key in the measure target height and backside bearing. Really important note before you hit measure, always double check you're using the correct prism constants. The large reflectors are at negative 30 while the prism that comes in the yellow backpack is at a plus 2 constant. Check to see if auto lock is on for convenience. Turn the jigger to the prism. When you have auto lock enabled it will snap to the center of the target and give you the sound clue. Target locked. Hit measure. This will give you a page with the measurement information. Hit store to save the backside point. Station setup completed. Next set of foresight, hit measure, measure topo, name the foresight, this one's 3, give it a code, key in the target height, turn the turtle station, hit measure, and then store. This is a good time to review your points and make sure the total station is recording the information. Hit favorites on menu, find point manager and this will list all the points you've recorded so far in your job. If the coordinates are coming up with question marks you may have set that job to MGA whilst using arbitrary coordinates. Hit escape when you're finished. Now it's time to record your features. Use the same recording method used to set up the foresight to measure the features of your job. To move to a station on the traverse hit escape. Go to the measure screen and click end conventional survey. Undo the total station from the tri rack. Use two hands to bring it into the carrying box. It only fits one way so make sure you've got it entered correctly. Close up the backpack. Make sure the latches are closed correctly. Make your way to the next station and change over the reflector. Lift out the turtle station and place it on the tri rack. Note the notch and line it up correctly. Once you have it leveled again, go to measure, VX and S series, station setup. Key in the point you move to, 
as well as its instrument height. Fill in data for the back sight. We're back sighting to station one. Turn the turtle station. Hit measure. Check your residuals, make sure they're within tolerance. Hit store and the station setup will be complete. To measure features from this new station, once again hit topo, set the point name, code, and start measuring away. To end the survey, exit to the main menu, hit measure, end conventional survey, exit and shut down general survey. Thanks for watching.